Larry's role in our company was to take the job from the initial blueprints all the way up to perfecting everything, hanging the pictures on the wall. He was full charge um, superintendent slash project manager. Building something is always a creative process and it's a collaborative process, which goes back to the people that you're working with. He just liked action and being outdoors and enjoying the sunshine. A bunch of us were skiing and snowboarding together. I made a bad choice at a split second. All of a sudden, there was a phone call from my wife who was in the back of the line and said, Larry just had an accident. Better come back up here. Came down on his head and neck and I think was instantly paralyzed. He went with me in, down the hill in the sled, in the ambulance to the emergency room. He never left. When I regained consciousness and realized uh, how badly uh, I was injured and how difficult um, I had made my life and my family's life, uh, I was completely, I was completely devastated. When the big guy takes the big hit, it's humbling to everybody. I was at a Craig Hospital, a rehab hospital in Denver uh, for four months. My wife took off from work. She stayed with me the whole time in the rehab hospital. His wife, she said, we're gonna fix this house. A bunch of the construction community sort of came together. Everybody chipped in and pretty quickly made it an accessible place. The caregivers are a huge expense. Out of pocket prescriptions, physical therapy. It wiped out our life savings, it wiped out my IRA, it wiped out everything. I wasn't getting well as fast as I thought I should. I didn't realize how much my mental attitude in terms of having hope to do anything else played a part in that. I ran into an old high school friend who encouraged me to get involved in the services that were at JVS. Larry's outlook was um, uncertain. Maybe I should be doing something completely different. The major benefit of the assessment process is for the participant to grow and discover what the next best step is. Through the testing, it honed right in. It all pointed back towards being a consultant in the construction field. His plan built on his transferable skills, his past extensive experience in the construction field. Jose was really instrumental. With this plan, I'd be certified as a consultant in the field of access for the disabled. There is a big demand for the services Larry will be able to provide. I'm currently taking a class at in the UCLA Extension Certificate Program for Construction Management. Really enjoyed being back in the classroom, being dropped off. I enjoyed being back around people in construction. Students, they all look up to him. He's doing great and inspiration, actually. I know he's been getting more independent, more enthusiastic, and more mobile on his own. I can really start to see a consulting business. Larry, he's always my go-to guy. I asked him for advice, and we rolled out the plans. It's been very rewarding spending a couple of afternoons a week with Chris if you just talked to him on the phone, you called him right now, you would never know that this is a guy in a wheelchair. I think he's got a lot to, to offer everybody. I'd love to have him back on the payroll. I can't wait. You have to make the most of what you have. JVS really helped me with that. Helped me turn the corner.